Hey guys, welcome back to Electrical Car Repair Live. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. In today's video, guys, we will show you how to remove and replace key fob battery on Nissan Cube, guys. If you have a Nissan Cube and you need to remove and replace your key fob battery, stay with us. We will explain what needs to be done, guys. If you need to buy a new battery, we will have the link in the description of the video below. In addition, you can find the part number, battery number there as well, guys. Uh, as you probably already know, Welcome to the channel. Every single vehicle we get at the shop, guys, we make at least 200 videos. We take them completely apart. We show you how to fi fix pretty much anything. And why we do that? Simply because our mission in the shop is to save you guys as much money as we can. All we need in return, guys, please subscribe to the channel and like the video. So hopefully, guys, you will find the information helpful. Now, this is the remote, guys. You may have the one with three or four keys. Okay, let me, let me show you what we'll be doing here. Three or four keys, uh, but the procedure will be the same for all of them. Okay, right there. Uh, and um, if it's shaped that way guys kind of like an egg you can see the procedure will be the same as you know guys if your remote dies and you cannot unlock your car you can manually unlock it you have a hidden key inside so let us show you guys okay how to do that okay right here now we have uh, we have one button that we need to slide out okay like that and when we slide it guys we're going to pull the key out let me show you now okay right there and you pull that key out. You need to get that key out anyways to remove and replace the battery as well, guys. So get it out because sometimes if you have it in, you may not be able to take the remote apart as easily. So go ahead, separate the two pieces, okay, by prying them out. Make sure you don't have any dust and dirt built inside as well, guys. That way, when you close it later, it will seal everything good and moisture and humidity will not build inside because otherwise, uh, your remote may uh, maybe damage guys so go ahead pull the battery out we'll get the uh, replacement battery now okay replacement battery right here you need to go in an angle guys okay in an angle under this plate this is the negative terminal of the battery pointing up you can see the picture here it explains how to install it the correct position align everything really good and while you're holding on one side down go ahead and start pressing everywhere until okay until everything is actually closed guys after that go ahead and put the key in from that point on your guys pretty much ready to go and your nissan cube key guys has a brand new battery in less than a minute as you can see not very complicated at all hopefully guys the video will be helpful to any of you trying to figure this thing out thank you guys for watching if you uh, if you have any questions let us know uh, that's how you guys get ideas for the videos usually uh, if you leave a comment we'll try to make a video for that problem in the future thank you for watching guys please subscribe to our channel for more videos and see you guys next time